What do you get when you cross Hollow Knight, Sekiro, and Cats? This game, maybe, I'm not sure. Sam and Nuggets, and welcome to Nine Souls. Uh, it looks int it looks interesting. It's a demo just now, um, but it looks very much up my alley. <laughs> Especially since I just got back into playing Sekiro again. <laughs> Granny cat, no. <laughs> Why? It's a good thing we have nine soul cats, nine, nine lives, soul, the soul's gate, tentacles. What the? This art style is amazing. <laughs> I love it. But what? <laughs> Heart was out, and I'm pretty sure I saw the cat's brain. <laughs> Snake. Please let that be grass and not hat is grass. Just hoping that it wasn't just a pile of hands. <laughs> Hi. What's happening? <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, I should probably mention as well, like this is in like super early development. Like they're they're forecasting that this won't be out. Is this cat smoking some ganja? <laughs> Big bro, I don't think we're even same species, but sure, man. <laughs> I smell barbecue fish all the way back there, so I knew you'd be here. Yes, that's what you smell. Forget that I'm cooking dinner today. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, you have to leave room for my carefully prepared delicacies. <laughs> Done! Kill the child! <laughs> oh, the seasoning is okay this time. Cook as much as you like. I'll eat it all. Let's, let's be a nice kitty. <laughs> okay, you've been here for ages. You must finally be getting used to the food, huh? Uh, oh, let's talk about food. I almost forgot to ask you for a favor. Is some of the secret how you don't follow me. Is this gonna be like every other game where like your first thing to do is like go collect a bunch of herbs? <laughs> hey, we can move. Okay, they're probably gonna teach me all this stuff anyway. <laughs> don't think there's any need for me to <laughs> try it all out now, but hey, that's secrets. No, there was, there was none. There was, I made a foolish fool of myself. But uh, yeah, this is this looks. I, I saw it and I was immediately like, do you know what? I've I've got a dead man's note. Fun. It's all. Is this like a com? Because it's all like technology around the sides and stuff like that. And we had like <laughs> a fake heart. <laughs> Interesting. Oh wait, uh, dead dead man's de de dead dead deadman. Uh, Je Steve Jeffman. There we go. Uh, we have a skill tree. Ah, oh, Ricky, did we use to a gin? If you are indeed a cat, I told you about the flower I needed for the worship ceremony. Uh, sure I do. That one. It's called the Crimson Hibiscus. We making tea? I need it during the ceremony. The ender say it symbolizes courage. So the larger, the better. I tried for ages, but could. Well, you're. <clears throat> If you, if it's not you that's doing it, then it's not really a test of cut. Anyway, do you think you could? Yes, yeah, sure. Oh no, it's a three-tailed piggy. It's the oh, what were they called? Uh, gin, 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 Judiki, something like that. Naruto. <laughs> it's the three-tailed boar. 
Uh, where'd that boar come from? Uh, the left. No, now we need to fight a boss in order to get the tea. <laughs> well, there goes my tea. Hold on, I'll bring it back for you. Or the boar hasn't gone far. <laughs> I'm gonna steal it back, but dang, Kang boars pretty fast. Cool. Uh, let's let's go kill our first thing. <laughs> What's this way? You won't let me go. <laughs> no more of this like <laughs> rapidly pressing A. <laughs> no more of this like rapidly <laughs> to jump. Hi. Can you? Can you? Now, there's no pole going. But then again, this game's meant to be about. I don't think we're getting to the advanced techniques just yet, given the fact that it's a pick. So it's. Oh, we exploded it into all sorts of viscera. <laughs> I got it. It's... Have it. Prior to the worship ceremony, the flower that bloomed in the abundance around the Peach Blossom Village are picked and used for decoration. Okay. Ye. My name is Ye. A mysterious tail alchemist. Or maybe, maybe, yes. Yes, that is me. A little boy who lives in Peace, uh, Peach Blossom Village. Where was the thing? Oh, I was going the wrong way. Where was the thing that I got? Heen. Energy stuff. Uh, we have bestiary. Dead man's note. Troops who are mad. Everyone's gone mad. You know, makes makes sense. You know, it wouldn't it wouldn't be one of these games if it wasn't that everybody had went ape shit. Anyway, hi, got the tea. What did you do in my absence? You know, injured are you? No, it literally could not interact with me. <laughs> Here's the flower. Great. Let's head back. Let's make some tea. I've got the pipe. I've got a cool hat. <laughs> I'm officially the lucky charm of the village. <laughs> Especially as you helped the elvers solve the mouse plague. They've been full of praise for you ever since. So, <clears throat> my, gra ca my cat grandma kicked me off a mountain. My heart was out my chest. My skull was definitely exposed. I rested in a wall for a couple of years, came out and then hunted some mice. And spent the rest of my time smoking ganja, I don't know. Uh, it's pretty graceful to soul to. Um, <clears throat> the everything it needs, so I almost forgot about the fish I hung out in front to dry. A bit of rush back. Okay, so I have to explore alone. Thank you. This is, uh, a, first and foremost, do you know what I mean? The, I can't jump. <laughs> oh no, I've entered an area of non hostility. I can't kill NPCs. Shaman. In ancient times, our ancestors resided in the harsh wastelands, subject to the bitter cold and the intrusion of beasts. The merciful souls couldn't bear to see humans. So, what are the what are the souls? I thought it was just like a kind of play on words. So, ten souls descend from the sky. Ah, wait, mm, ah, ten. Ah, where's nine? Is the title? What happened to the tenth one? At first, people were ignorant and responded to the goodwill of the soul by wielding weapons. So, this kid's really into tap dancing right now. Those fools make God's wrath. Their bones turn to ash. Great. To follow the soul to the land outside the 99 heavens, a paradise where no one wanted for anything. The all-knowing and all-powerful souls bestowed humans with wisdom, teaching us about the truth of all things. Could I have some of that blessing? Because I have... <laughs> I know the truth of very few things. <laughs> uh, why are humans so blessed? It's because the soul and all supreme wisdom saw divinity in human beings. They might have cocked up on that one. Uh, each time the peach is ripened for harvesting, the souls select several kind humans from our land, and these lucky individuals get to become one of the souls. Really? Because you pick fruit. Interesting. Be good children, as long as you follow the teachings. And say, oh, they're, they're telling us to the Waynes. Oh, right. They're telling us to me, and I'm, I'm not buying any of this. This is you just trying to make sure the Waynes day work. Sl sleep labor is what it is. Right, one day you get a chance to be summoned by the gods. Interesting. You know how much I love... Oh, it's because of the backdrop. You know how much I love games of lore? 
divine soul in heaven, I humbly ask that you need our request. Our... Oh, it's you. I was like, what is that sound? It's this guy drinking sake. <laughs> I can't help but notice that you um you have two hernias bursting out your temple, mate. Do you want a hand with that? Well, look at the hell you're looking at. Beat it. <laughs> look at these people blindly going about their day. <laughs> they actually think they're doing something meaningful, as opposed to the gentleman sitting here getting absolutely pished. Last year, my daughter was chosen to live with the gods. Oh, great. Well, I'm sure she's happy. Must be joyful, but no one, none of them come back to tell us, so no one really knows. I have the feeling the souls aren't <laughs> quite what they're uh, made out to be. Thanks for your help today. Uh, all customers to wear this flower during the ceremony. Only the chosen get to wear it. Uh -huh. There's a written rule. The bigger the flower, the more glory you receive. Great, am I going to have the biggest bloody flower I've known to you lot? I can't believe it was me that was chosen. Oh, you were chosen. All right. Is it because I always try to do good, or because my parents put in a good word for me with the gods? Uh, <laughs> God knows. <laughs> Silent or God knows. Uh, God, God only knows. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Guess it's impossible to know what the gods are thinking. But yeah, let's go home. The ceremony is just in a few days. And let's do a lot. Okay. Oh, so this is where we stay. I thought I just lived in that cave. <laughs> Do you remember the first time we met? It was the day mum and dad were chosen by the gods. Everybody had been congratulating my family, but then it was just me left at home when I was lonely. Still being chosen by the gods uh, is cause for celebration, so I couldn't let it. So your parents were chosen by the gods. It wasn't that your parents like died or anything like that. But then again, <laughs> somewhat suspicious. Uh, went to my secret hideaway and played the flute. I didn't count on seeing someone buried inside of a mountain. You are pretty scary at first. You never spoke and always wore that hat of yours. But your culinary skills were incredible. <laughs> Just doesn't speak. Wears a hat. Makes sushi. Exactly the kind of character development I'm looking for. <laughs> And you tell me these fascinating stories when I couldn't sleep. Oh, and also you're so talented. You leap onto the roof and fix tiles like it was nothing and your hunting skills are top notch. Great. I, g I get that I'm amazing. Why do you think I was chosen by the gods? Okay. <laughs> Look at it. I wish you could come with me. I I'm sure I'll be coming up there shortly. I'm still a little scared of going to an unknown place all by myself. I have nothing to say. <laughs> Well, the worst sorry, the one's only a few days away. Are you sure you won't come? It's my big day. I really hope you can be there. I'm not good with crowds. You'll be okay by yourself. That's true. You never liked crowds. Great. I'm glad that I'm learning so much. <laughs> you change your mind. Feel free to come along. Say hi. And no, I'm not you sure you'll be okay after I'm gone. Uh, you, well, I mean, you've already spent the last several minutes telling me how amazing I am. You've not really been bigging yourself up much. <laughs> I skipped in the bucket, the fruit on the table must be eaten before it dries. Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> on the day of the ceremony. Dun dun. Incoming signal. <laughs> Aye. <laughs> Talking. Is that it's. Wait. <laughs> Is that its name? Its name is Talking? Or it's just letting me know that it is Talking? Because I, I think its name is Talking. <laughs> Ye, it's me. Your wounds must have been pretty much healed by now. I just want to remind you that the time has come. The passageway only opens again in half a year. If you miss it this time, you'll be in dire straits. Make a move already. Those animals have kept you long enough. But remember, be discreet. Don't let yourself be seen. Oh. What do, you mean? what do you mean, be discreet? <laughs> be discreet doing what? Hi again. What were you doing sneaking about just now? Uh, I wasn't sneaking. I was just talking to myself. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't sneaking. 
Save it. I knew there was something fishy about you. Don't you think you could fill me just because you wear a bamboo hat? <laughs> Bars in the sky. Gods. I don't know who made up that hogwash, but I know it's odd. Laugh all you want. You wait and see. I'll prove it to these morns. Aha. Uh -huh, great, man. I'ma just uh, slunk by you. All right. I can't. <laughs> They've put. Oh no. They've put up beads. <laughs> Beautifully this year. Uh huh. That's great. I'm just. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just. I'm just going to walk. You know. I don't like crowds. You know. I don't want to hang about everybody. I'm just gonna. Just gonna. Oh. Skate. Never mind. Bells. Definitely a second one inspired. <laughs> I'm really liking this um this kind of like combination of like technology and kind of like am I meant to be bowing? I don't I, I, they didn't teach me the button for bow. This is, this is when this is just like a like an ad farm. <laughs> like all these people are like the gods, but it's actually. Ah, uh, uh, kid, kid. <laughs> Funny thing, I don't know where we keep the peanut butter, so you need to come home uh, and you need to show me where we keep that. I literally can't do anything. I'm gonna have to watch this Wayne get beheaded. <laughs> or maybe it's too small. Maybe it's too small for the machine. Too small for the. Oh no. Big bro, thank you for taking care of me these past two years. I'm going now. No. No. <laughs> Uh, to attach Foo Charm. This is interesting as well. I'm really liking this comic book style. <gasps> now you have to fight the gods! I have blown up the gods! <laughs> oh gods, please spare us from your wrath. Nah, gods could go fuck themselves. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, look, uh, I'm not your big bro. <laughs> now we tell him. Now we break his heart and tell him. <laughs> I must go now. You look after yourself. Wait, I don't understand. What just happened? Why did you do that? <laughs> look, it'll, it'll, you'll, it'll make sense eventually. <laughs> it's so funny. It's got this like ancient, you know, mythology feel and then it's like, yeah, whole beat hack. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> this is where all the bodies went. <laughs> Human body treatment. And now I have a health bar. Now, now we're in it. <laughs> now we're in it. Now we're, we're in for it. <laughs> okay. Okay, to deflect attacks. And then, food charm. And then Danny. Ho oh. <laughs> Ah oh Oh that's that's a good sign. I look oh I I just Yes Yes <laughs> How do you how do you make yourself feel better? Smoking <laughs> Geezies uh, right, now we're into the, into the thick of it. What do you do? Interact. Ooh. 
root node rest. Ah, I get, I get a use of foo charms from deflecting, and then but right, I understand now. This is a. Uh, I want in there. I want the advertisements for new body parts. <laughs> Dway and Dwa. Hi. Uh huh. Uh huh. Can I? Oh, I can. I still take damage using the food charm, so it's not like it's a dash. And another. Nice. I wonder if I think maybe I can use just uh. <laughs> Blood soaked crimson hibiscus. Crimson hibiscus is soaked with villagers' blood. The, bleed, the breeding facility regularly gathers up ape men bodies dismembers them, and sorts their body parts. Yep, yeah, thought so. <sighs> Unusable resources such as flowers are inevitably get mixed in, stuffed into bags along with eight men body parts. Things I currently, uh, certainly wouldn't want to see his flower end up like this. No, no, I can't, uh, I can't imagine that they would. No, this is... <laughs> <laughs> this is fucked up. Oh, look at all the bodies moving in the back. This is fucked up, and I love it. <laughs> ah! No. No. Don't like ranged. Don't you. Just... Look, you. Just, you. Actually, just you came here. There we go. It's <laughs> like all this deflection and shit. Just die. Spe spears. No, no, no. No. I hate spears. I hate... There we go. I'll use them. I'll use them to be to be rid of spearmen. <laughs> what are they? There's the body part, and then they just lop the limbs off. What are you doing with the heads? Why? Why do the heads need to be kept separate? <laughs> oh, they're pickling the. Okay, I need to save up two points from you. There we go, because there's a big boy over here. Who I can't get access to. They're pickling the body parts. Oh god. <laughs> too many, too many, too many. I wasted it. Ah, okay, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Don't. Oh, well, and now I get to figure out what happens if we die. How much. Like, said games that we know. Is. Granda, look. Grandma has been a cow. Uh, send me back. <laughs> I, look, <laughs> just gonna say, I, I managed to grasp the concept of combat pretty easily. Ah ha ha I know you've got a big sword, but that doesn't mean anything. Oh, and I have deflections. <laughs> and what is you? Good things money. <laughs> okay, let's try and get back to where we were. I totally remember where it was. Oh. Wait. What is this? It looks... It looks incredibly phallic. Um... <laughs> oh, you little bitch. You can move your target and okay, I thought maybe you would just shoot in a straight line, but apparently the major AI is slightly more advanced. The origin of Ape Man. I'd love to read it. The origin of the Ape Man. Uh, a scroll that chronicles the feeding methods and origins of Ape Man. Ape-Man originate from a planet known as 
as the pale blue dot mention of this planet first appeared in the deep space telescope reported uh, report issued by the Haotian Sphere. It is known uh, in the known firmament. Ape men are one of the rare life forms that possess high levels of intelligence. That's funny. Even before genetic modification, they possess basic linguistic abilities and their capability of abstract thought. The frequency denotes violent behaviour at the same time due to their social nature when captured. Okay, so furries have taken o over. No, this is like, a, I was going to say furries have taken over, but no, it's like a completely different <laughs> timeline. <laughs> Well, I don't know. Maybe this is the time one. <laughs> Warning. Unusual activity detected in breeding zone. Perimeter breach by or <laughs> living Oria. I thought something was coming. Uh oh, it's us and him. Incoming signal. Talking. Hi, talking. It's all happening. With that stunt of yours, it looks like new Pengli uh, will be a buzz with the commotion for a while. Why did you strike that early? <laughs> it wasn't part of the plan. Was it to save that human child? If you always break with protocol, uh, if you always break with protocol, it's going to be really tough to execute our plans. <laughs> Telepathy? No. <laughs> you got an apple. <laughs> you got an apple AirPod stuck right in your skull. Uh, it was just a spark of impulse. It's none of your business. Know your place. Know your place. Talking. I know what my duties are. Don't worry. It's just, if you'd waited a bit longer before destroying the machine, I could have covered up the alarm. I hope you'll stick with this. Is there, I'm pretty sure there's a cat in that machine. Kinda. Uh, stick to the script. Uh, nah, the script? Are you insane? Right, so, we're here, but also the drunk dude's here. Are you going to be a boss? <laughs> Hi, talking. Uh huh. Uh oh, it's a checkpoint. Thanks. You set off the intrusion alarm to unlock the gate. You must first take out all the guards. Yeah, sure. Get right on that. Get right. Get right. Get right. Get right on that. Um, good thing none of these can jump. So I can take you out at my leisure. Okay, I would very much like to take out Wimpy Boy first. Hey. Go. Ah ha ha! No, <laughs> I was just gonna go heal, but apparently he felt the need to take half my health away. Thanks, thanks for that, man. Ah, just had to get you. Nice. Right, checkpoint cleared. Stop! 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 Stop it! Oh, I just realized as well. So, when it takes my health off, I'll, 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 I'll no doubt get another chance to show you, or you've already clocked it before. I did. Fuck. If you block a, if you get a partial block, attacking gives you health. So it's also bloodborne <laughs> stuff as well. I love the, uh, I love the rally system in bloodborne. So that's that's interesting that I can uh, I can also get health back. So I was just thinking there, I was like, I wonder if there's like stuff that you could get that's like attacks will give you health back and stuff like that. But I've went into the skill system and I haven't gotten any uh, skill points yet. Which I imagine is that yellow thing up the top. Those boys hit hard. Oh, I was like, dying doesn't seem to have any kind of detriment. My yellow bar has went down significantly. Can you come back here? Even if you just get the partial, you can still need... Cool, so is that skill point? There we go. I thought so. Right, so what could we get? Iron armor increases defense and takes less damage. We could get... Oh, hey. 
Um, charm enhancement, enhance the damage inflicted by chi explosions, or we could get force reduction reduces the terrible damage caused by precision deflections. I'm gonna go with this one for now. Um, but that's good as well because it really incentivizes me to not just run by everything. Same as Sekiro, do you know what I mean? Like, obviously, I haven't played through that. It's, you can't, it, like, it gives you that freedom of movement where if you just don't want to fight everything, you've got that option to just not fight everything and just go your own way, do you know what I mean? But you're insensitized to actually fight stuff because you want to try and get uh, experience and stuff. Is this a refill? That's uh, that's a lot like the the little soul totems in Hollow Knight. This is, ah, I want this out! <laughs> this, this is really scratching that itch, do you know what I mean? And I'm really... Um, I'm really liking this deflection system. This is a really... This is a really good um, uh, amalgamation of of ideas I don't really like. I don't like you archers though. Hi. <laughs> hi fella. Oh, hi. That's a cool weapon you have. This is like cyberpunk and... and... Oh! <laughs> Red Tiger Elite doesn't mess about. <laughs> oh, okay. I get it. I get it. Red Tiger Elite. You like to do multi attacks. I'm gonna just heal over here. With, yeah, there we go. Bye. Oh, die. <laughs> heal. I wonder if uh, later down the line I'll be able to use my, my chi nodes to heal rather than to do rather than to do damage that'll be interesting though I suppose with how rapidly I get how rapidly I get she probably not I do I just I do just love the fact that the heal is literally like ah, I've been attacked oh wrong button I'm like, ah, I've been attacked. Anyway, <sighs> just standing behind him having a smoke. Right, this is the dodge button. I've not been using the dodge button a whole lot because it's because it's that second row training, you know. The dodge isn't as important as the deflections. Boom and smoke. Ah, I didn't realize you were in the middle of a combo, dear friend. Okay, so I don't get any rally. I don't get any rally from. Try heal from doing the explosions. Hey, duck. Nearly there. Right. Goodbye, Red Tiger Elite. Oh, <laughs> it's all your, all your. Oh, your bits have fell out. <laughs> anyway, just, just gonna take it left. Pa bye. <laughs> Thank you for playing Nine Souls demo. Oh man! If you like the game, we welcome you to visit our crowdfunding page and support us. Boss Challenge: The Red Centaur has been unlocked for me to play the now. It, ah, boss Challenge. Interesting. This uh, I'll play this while I. I distribute my thoughts um this is this could be something really really cool it already has something really really cool uh that's not the right why <laughs> uh, my name is it's masataka oniwa <laughs> jesus um this already is a really, really cool idea. Uh, obviously, the thing is, is, is to make a full game out of it could be difficult. Because, um... But... Oh, Jesus, these attacks are nuts. So... Okay, you die, you, uh... 
you, you die. You get uh, stunned for that one. Just some choice. Um, yeah, it could be difficult to make like a whole game out of it and stuff like that. But see if they could manage to get like a like a decent amount. Of, I'm not talking like 50 hours of gameplay or anything like that. Do you know what I mean? But even if they could just like pan this out into like a 12 hour game or something, that would be awesome. Uh, I thought you were gonna do the poke. That you no, know, you're not doing the poke. Do the poke. That's not the poke. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> There's the poke. <laughs> now, how many does four do? Not as much as one would like. And now I'm dead. <laughs> um. Okay, I'll play that a wee bit to myself. Uh, can we? Can we exit? Not in the middle of the, the fight, unfortunately. But yeah, there's like certainly things that you can tell that there's that it's not quite done yet. But see the art style and stuff like that of it. Like I, I am super in love with this. Um, it kind of reminds me of that other that uh, that other game. What was it called again? I can't for the life of me remember what it's called. But I, I know that I wanted to play that as well. But this is like I love the the deflection concept of it. Like take, taking and that's the thing like. I'm not opposed to all these people that are like, uh, it's so like, genre. Uh. Like, fuck up, man. It's, everything is a genre of its own. Everything is basically, since the dawn of time, everything is just a copy of something else with a wee bit of garnish put on top of it. That is literally it. So, putting, like, Metroidvania, I, I always say Hollow Knight because that's the only real Metroidvania that I've played. But putting, like, Hollow Knight with Sekiro kind of like deflection combat like you, if you've watched me play Hollow Knight I I know that there's a concept of like parrying the moves I just could never do it reliably <laughs> but um like making that an, an integral part of this like doing deflections and stuff like that adding the rally system all that kind of stuff is stuff that I really love about the games that I've played so taking all those wee bits out of the games and sticking them all together and putting it with like a really really cool art style like even just like the way that like the, the buckles and stuff like that move on like the ass of this red centaur. Do you know what I mean? Like as it moves right around stuff like that. Like, it's, so, it's so well done. And I'm really looking forward to what this turns into when they finish it. Um, like if it will have like a really decent story, if it will, you know, if it will be shrouded in mystery, or if it will be very much spoon fed to us. Um, all that kind of stuff, but it, generally, that looks amazing and I cannot wait. Um, I'll put the link for the game, I'll put the link for the crowdfund, all that kind of stuff in uh, the description down below. If you want to go play the demo for yourself, if you want to go support it, um, by all means it'll be in there. But that is your whack for Nine Souls for today. Um, very much looking forward to playing that when it finally, uh, finally comes out. Interesting. Um, but yeah, that's your whack. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, bat the subscribe button, like the video, keys your banner in the section down below, all that jazz, and I'll catch you nuggets in the next one. Alright, cheerio bye.